YouTube, y'all. Welcome back to Mega Five Stars. YouTubers edition. Guys, I know I've been... I haven't been on here for about maybe over a week. Um, it's been a long week. It's been a long... It's been a long couple of weeks. A long couple of weeks. Um dealing with pain and stuff like that but um you know it is what it is but i'm back i'm back um but guys really i've i've been on youtube i've been watching youtube but i gotta say this guys i just gotta be up front what's going on with youtube <laughs> what is going on with the content on youtube i'm confused I'm confused. It's going downhill. I mean, the content. Where is the content? And I don't know. I mean, it's there. It's probably there. But I don't know. Is it just me, guys? It's just, is it just me? There's like, you know, people aren't putting out good content. Like, it's just a lot of fake content. And like, really, people want realistic. Me, I like realistic um things like i don't really even watch tv much you know because i like reality things i like um i like things like you know real things real things that's really happening like i wa like watching stuff like that so i'm not like a tv person really um like i said like i watch reality tv and then sometimes that's script so i like a lot of documentaries i watch a lot of documentaries things of that nature but i have to say like the content is mm, it's going down here but i gotta say this guys let me give let me give mega five stars to one of the content creators that i totally watch all the time and i don't know if you watch them but um nba kwan and his uncle howard so it's nba kwan and his uncle howard and let me tell you, I just love watching their content. So they make me laugh. They make me laugh all the time. But guys, I'm going to put their, um, their little picture up here or whatever. But go check them out. Uh, his channel name is Choo Choo and Quan. So they got so many names for their uncle. To be honest with you, when they first started, they was calling their uncle Auntie, right? So when they first started... He was calling his son, his um, uncle, auntie. So, my crazy self, I was thinking that, um, you know, his uncle was a woman, but was turned transgender or something at first because they was always calling him auntie, him and his brother. So, I thought he was transgender or something like that. You know, nothing wrong with transgender people you know they do their thing whatever whatever but i just thought he was transgender because they was calling him auntie <laughs> so it was crazy but to find out that no he's actually a man they just be playing with him like that but anyway choo choo and kwan i love their channel i love their content they are so funny and i just love watching them so go check them out but anyway they keep my spirits up i always watch them a lot so that's one thing I've been watching on YouTube. Then another thing I've been watching on YouTube is I just like, I just be curious and really into like the African, how some people in like Kenya and, and all of them other islands or whatever like that, how they be living still today in 2023, like in the huts and how they cook and how they wash and how they got to go get their water and you know, they still don't have, like, some places still don't have, like, running water. They still living in, like, you know, like, mud huts and stuff like that. So, it's just curious to see how they survive and how they live, you know, off of what they, you know, can live. I mean, they make it work with whatever they have. And it's just, it, it's just some good content creators in, um, like, Africa and stuff like that that actually let people into their personal lives, like, let let us see how they take baths and things of that nature. So I just found it to be really um, intriguing to watch um, just to see how they cook, how they clean and stuff like that. I mean, 
Like they don't have, a, you know, in that particular, in certain particular places, they don't have like, um, again, they don't have running water. They don't have floors, like finished floors, like, you know, like tile and stuff like that in their home off of like, they're walking on the dirt in their homes and how they have to sweep it out and stuff. So anyway, that kind of content intrigues me. I just like to watch to see how them people survive. And on top of that, how they are so graceful. Like they live their life so peaceful and graceful and they, you know, love each other. And they even said, one place even said they don't have any crime there. So they're able to leave open their doors like their, their huts, you know, they don't have crime and stuff like that. So it was just, it's just intriguing to see, but, um, you know, I just pray one day I could, you know, they can get some running water, you know what I mean? To where they don't have to walk and, and get water and stuff. But anyway, I've been watching that on YouTube. So if you ever want to search like, um, African, um, life and, um, or, um, African daily life or daily living, Africa daily life or daily living and stuff like that. Um, it's just, it's just something, you know, because, you know, just, it's just something to see. So I've been watching that. I've been watching that kind of content a lot and just getting in tune with other parts of the world. And um, another content creator that people be sleeping on me, I think he's so cute and I really think that he, um, you know, he brings good content with his new girlfriend. He always having a new girlfriend look like ever since he broke up with his baby mother. But that's DDG's cousin, Von, Von TV, um, or Von, just look up Von. But anyway, I just like his content with his girlfriend and stuff like that. It's good. To, it's nice to watch and everything. And so I be watching that. I'm gonna put you on my. I'm putting you on my um YouTube. My YouTube. I'm letting them hear you. <laughs> Cause I was in the middle of doing YouTube. At first, I stopped the camera. Well, I said shoot, don't put it up there. But mom, what you doing? So it, you, the package got there. Yeah, and this is. I, I, I'm telling you, this is like I'm in Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's so whimsical. I'm like, okay, what am I gonna do with it? Oh, look at this page. Well, <laughs> is this a journal? Guys, so I made my mom a journal, a personal journal, and it's a three-piece journal. It's a mini journal, a big, it's a journal slash scrapbook. Actually, Ma, you could put pictures in that one too if you want the big one. And uh, and you could just write in it or do whatever you want with it. But you like little spots that's open on the pages or whatever, you could put pictures. Yes. Tea time. Right. So, I like tea time. So, anyway, so, guys, um, I'm going to let you know. And with the safety pins, it probably stays up, but I have to uh, redo it for somebody to pin up. Right. <laughs> and then, like, at the same time on that page, you could put down their measurements and stuff like that, and then you have your little pins there in that page. Yes, 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 yes. Good idea. That's what you probably meant but, for. And right and do you see like how i changed the pin cushion like it was paper it's just it was pure paper but i made the um i took the pin cushion and i just put, took another piece of paper and i added that acetate in it so it have a window and i made a pocket and then i put the pins in it man i wouldn't know how to do none of this <laughs> it's nice ain't it <laughs> But look, I I saved the picture. Keep people measurements in it. I'm gonna keep my little personal stuff oh, in it. Mom, all my love. Oh, look at her with a little girl dressed with uh, yeah, mommy and making up. Guys, I'll be back. All right, guys. So I'm back. I'm back. My mom just got another part of her Mother's Day gift. I um, so I sent her her Mother's Day gift and. Uh, the first part of her gift, um, I just, I just sent her some flowers and stuff yesterday for Mother's Day because I knew 
the the part that I was making her wasn't going to be there in time for Mother's Day. So I wanted her to have something for Mother's Day. So I sent her some flowers and chocolate and stuff like that. And then she finally got my um the journal that I made her. It was like a three-part journal. It, it was a three-set. came with a card, a big journal, and a small journal. But it's customized. It's It's got like little gadgets and stuff in it. So she was just talking about it. So yeah, that's what I did for my mom. And it took me about a month to finish it because, of course, I'd be in pain. But I had to do it. I had to do it for my mom. I ain't care nothing about no pain. But anyway, um, yeah, so that's what she was talking about. But I just wanted to stop and say to you guys, to the mothers out there, and everybody who watched my channel that's a mom, happy Mother's Day. Um, I hope you enjoyed your day. I hope it was a blessed day. day. And I just want to say happy Mother's Day to you every day enjoy your mother's day every day because it is a blessing guys real quick if you want to go check out what i made my mom i wasn't going to share my other channel with this channel because i didn't want it to like i just wanted to keep it kind of separate but i said forget it like my true viewers if you want to go check out what else i do in my spare time uh when i'm not in pain and something to do to relax me i like doing crafts and different projects and the and everything so if you want to get different ideas on what you can do just go ahead and go check me out as first that's the number one st choice c-h-o-i-c-e and then crafts c-r-a-f-t-s here on youtube um it's a fairly new channel i mean it's been up but i just became real more active on it per se um, again, I only do it in my spare time and when I'm not in pain or whatever. Um, I like to do crafts because it calms me down. It, I mean, it just relaxes me a little bit whenever I can. So anyway, guys, go check me out again. It's a, it's not a lot of subscribers over there or whatever. So go ahead and get me up to a thousand for my true viewers. But again, I just became more active on it. So I'm giving it time to grow. But anyway, back to the regular schedule program. So anyway, guys, let's get back into the content. Let's get into the content. I don't know where I was before. I was talking about so many things since I started the, um started this um video. But anyway, let's get into the content. So yeah, <clears throat> that's what I've been watching because the videos have been people's content lately have been trash. I, I'm gonna just put it out there, trash. But anyway. I enjoy watching them. I do enjoy watching the people that I watch, but it just wasn't given what it's supposed to give this month. But anyway, guys, so let's get on to CJ So Cool's new content. It's got to grow on me. I have to tell you, it's got to grow on me because um, uh, I, it's like, I don't know. Is he struggling to find content? And then on top of that, what happened to um, D-Lo? Like, D-Lo is not doing his content no more. I guess he didn't like the way D-Lo was editing his content. And um, he felt as though his um, his views for some of his content was dropping. So, he decided he wanted to do his editing himself. Me, personally, I think he need D-Lo back. I think he need D-Lo back because it wasn't that bad. You know, to me, he just, it's just... I don't know. It's missing something. But I guess I just have to get used to him doing content without the kids, per se. I guess that's what it is. Because it's missing something. It's just missing something. But um, I see that he's doing more content with Lexi, his girlfriend. And um, I kudos to Lexi for sticking in there, for sticking with him. I mean, she's really down for her man. I mean, it looks like she's really down for him. Like, she's... She's doing everything and anything that he wants. And, you know, kudos to her. You know, she's sticking by him. She's helping him with his kids. And her mom's helping. So sweet. That's just sweet. That's just sweet. And um, so, yeah, I, I guess Lexi is growing on me. I mean, I have to say at first, no. I wasn't feeling it because, you know, I was because I'm a woman and I was feeling for royalty. I must say. I have to tell you that. Yes, I was feeling for royalty. And I was feeling bad for her that, you know, her man is gone and then went on to this Lexi person. And so, yeah, you know, I was kind of, you know, feeling kind of down for, uh, you know, feeling the type of way for about it because of royalty. But 
Lexi going on me. And then now one tea is in her own space. So let's get on to that. One tea is outside, guys. One tea is outside. <laughs> listen, listen. Like I said, at first, yes, when your kids, your babies go away, that that gets on your nerves, man. And then you worry about them. You constantly worry about them. And this is when they first start going away. Yeah. I mean, her, her babies go with their dad for a couple of days. Yeah, you know, you worry about them. Those are her babies. But then after a while, like I said, guys, you get used to it. And then you start saying, well, what? When he going, you know, uh, when when is Saturday coming? When is the weekend coming? Because that's when her kids go to him. She's going to be looking forward to that, uh, you know, after a while. And it looks like she's having a ball now. She looks like she adapted pretty well. She's outside. She's outside. <laughs> and um, look like she's having a good time with her little boo, her new little boo. And um, I have to give it up for her and see she's doing her thing. She's hanging in there. She's hanging in there. And it also looks like she's getting a couple of gigs. Looks like she's getting some gigs. Um, She's going to be hosting a party. I think it was this Thursday or was that next, last Thursday. But anyway, she's got a couple of gigs where she's hosting um a little something at a uh, at a club or something. So um, that's, that's what's up. She's doing her thing. She's doing her thing. And, um, you know... She's gonna get used to it now. She she probably not gonna she she gonna be looking forward to the kids going to uh to um CJ so cool when she see all the freedom once she get used to all this freedom that she's having you know during the weekends and then you know I have to say you know but I'm wondering you know is that kind of fair <laughs> but I guess it is what it is the mom had the kids doing a week parent the dad could get them through the weekend but i i just think they should alternate weekends at least give cj a weekend you know to where they alternate it but he might not mind he might not mind having them on the weekend if he having them doing during the week so and then was he boo take a little shot at cj so cool <laughs> like deep was that a shot was that a dick so he showed his pants and it had grinch on it and then he said, the Grinch that stole your... Oh, shit. <laughs> Sit with the star. Feel me? The Grinch you stole your bitch. <laughs> so was that a shot? I see Jessica. I don't know, guys. I don't think so. Because, um... I don't see how he would steal her from CJ so cool because... CJ so cool, let her go. So, I don't know. I don't know, but was that a dig? Was that a dig? <laughs> anyway. <laughs> it's but Yeah, I'm, I'm just, uh, you know, that's what's up. That's what's up. Like she, she um, getting in close with her boo, too, because she, she sure posting him a lot. And is he, a, he, did he come down? How long he staying to where she at? Or did she go to him? I don't know, but look like they're doing their thing. So, yeah, guys, that's what's going on in uh, CJ and Royalty's world. Um, but CJ, I just hope it works out for him because it looks like he's, like, really not struggling, but trying to figure out content for his channel. I think that's really, it seems like to me that that's really on his mind a lot, like getting those numbers back where they used to be. Because, you know, his, his numbers aren't as good as they used to be. But this is YouTube. This is YouTube. You you can have good numbers one week and then the next week you you your numbers be trash. It's but it's YouTube. Put the content out anyway. You know, whoever messes with your channel gonna mess with your channel regardless. Whoever's gonna watch it is gonna rewatch it regardless. Just put the content out there. Don't beat yourself up over it, guys. If you're doing your YouTube and you're not getting as much, so what? Just put your content out there. Somebody's watching it. I don't care if it's one person. Somebody's watching. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please make sure you like and subscribe and stay tuned for my next video. Done.